So could the Philadelphia 76ers be trading away P.J. Tucker to the Los Angeles Lakers this 2023 NBA offseason? Well, here on the screen is a trade proposal or a trade idea uh, from NBAanalysis.net. The link to this article is down below in case you want to check out the entire thing uh, for yourself. But this trade would see the Philadelphia 76ers receiving Gabe Vincent and Torian Prince and the Los Angeles Lakers receiving P.J. Tucker, Patrick Beverly, a 20. 24 second round pick and a 2027 second round pick. Now, in my personal opinion, it's actually a pretty big time trade for the Lakers to make if they're able to pull this off uh, in some capacity, right? Getting back to veteran players uh, in PJ Tucker and former Laker uh, Patrick Beverly, although that's sort of how that ended last year. It may not be in either party's best interest to make that reunion happen, but nonetheless, I think Patrick Beverly would bring a lot to the table uh, for the Lakers as well as two second round picks. That's pretty damn good if you ask me. Now, I know the Lakers brought in Gabe Vincent this year as well as Torrey and Prince. So I'm not really too sure uh, if they want to trade those guys this quickly, but if you're able to sort of get more veterans around LeBron James and Anthony Davis, like PJ Tucker and like Patrick Beverly, uh, as well as some second round draft pick, which uh, second round draft capital, which you could always, I guess, flip down the road. That's always possible. May actually be a pretty good move uh, for both sides to make, right? If you're the 76ers, you're getting back uh, two pretty solid players, uh, you know, two, three, and D guys like Gabe Vincent and Torian Prince. Uh, and you're getting rid of two older players, two veteran players like PJ Tucker and Patrick Beverly. So, honestly speaking, a pretty solid option for both teams, especially too with Christian Wood uh, signing with the Lakers a couple, you know, weeks ago now. This could be a pretty good idea uh, to sort of load up for a championship run this year by adding a lot of veteran players, making this team a lot deeper, and sort of going all in for this year. Uh, while LeBron James is still healthy uh, and still with the Lakers uh, at a very high level in regards to his play. So uh, I'm a big fan of this trade for the Lakers, but I'm also a pretty big fan of this trade for the 76ers, a pretty even trade. But if I had to pick a winner of this trade, I'd probably say the Lakers just by a tiny a little bit. So, you know, make sure to leave all your thoughts down below as always. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.